Hi, I'm Jeremy Giapukai. I'm going to report the Chapter 3, Probability. Chapter Outline 3.1, Basic Concept of Probability and Counting 3.2, Conditional prob Probability and Multiplication Rule The Addition Rule 3.4, Additional Topics in Probability and Counting Here, the section 3.2, Conditional Probability and Multiplication Rule. Here are the objectives of three, section 3.2. How to find the probability of an event given that another event has occurred. How to distinguish between independent and dependent events. Number three, how to use multiplication rule to find the probability of two events occurring in, in sequence and to find conditional probabilities. Conditional probability. Conditional probability, an event or outcome, outcome occurring given that another event has already occurred. Note, probability of B given A. So for example, Two cards are selected in sequence from a standard deck. Find the probability that the second card is a queen given the first card is a king. Assume that, that the king is not replaced. Solution. Because the first card is a king and is not replaced. The remaining deck has 51 cards, 4 of which are queens. Probability of B given A is equal to prob probability second card is a queen given, give, given first card is a king is equal to 4 over 51 equals to 0 0.078. Sample number 2. The table show the res result of survey in which 2,276 2, social media users were as whether they have ever been offended by something they saw on social media. Find the prob probability that a user is male, given that user was offended by something on social media. So here are the table. First question, have you ever been offended by first, I mean, first column, have you ever been offended by something on social media? Female, got 619 yes male well the male male is 532 In the third column uh, female got no got 549 no and male got 576 got no total of 1125 third column have you ever been offended by the something on social media? And total of of total total of yes or no of the female is one thousand one hundred sixty eight, and the and the male is eleven uh, one thousand one hundred eight. Total of two thousand two hundred seventy six. There are one thousand one hundred fifty one users who said they were offended by something on social media. So the sample space consists of these 1,151 users. Of these, 532 are males. So probability given by B, uh, probability, probability of B given A is equal to 532 over 1,151 is equal to 0.462. Dependent and dependent events. In dependent events, that occurrence of one of, of the events does not affect the probability of occurrence of the other event. So, in dependent events, is connection to another event. Uh, probability B given A is equal to probability of B or probability of A given B is equal to probability of A. Events that are not independent are dependent. For, for example, uh, 
decide whether the events are the independent or dependent. Number one, selecting a king from a standard deck of 52 playing cards, not replacing it, and then selecting a queen B from the deck. So, solution. Probability B given A is equal to probability of second card is a queen given first card is a king is equal to 4 over 51. Now, P probability of B is equal to P probability of queen is equal to 4 over 52.